Hey, it's getting real special over here. That's why we had to bring a special type of nigga. We got Salvador Domingo in this motherfucker, man. You know what it you is? Did. You know what yeah. it is? Yeah. Stand up comedian, a real actor. <laughs> you know what it is? I'm just here to fuck up the budget a little bit. Hey, man, you fucked I'm gonna it up. I'm going to be ordering other foods <laughs> periodically. Yeah, you the, you the <laughs> I got Ruth Chris coming later. <laughs> yeah, you the first nigga who said, what's for what's for you uh, on your rider and shit? That we weren't prepared for that. I said, damn, rider, nigga. I thought you were coming out the love, the shrimp. <laughs> <laughs> nigga sent requests where he won't talk about. I was like, God damn. Clay Cole. You played sports in high school and college? I did track in high school. For real? Oh, so you were fast as a motherfucker. Mm -hmm. What you long jump or some shit? I could jump high jump. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I high oh. jump my ass off. Paul Bolton and shit. No. I jump. I used a scissor kick too. I ain't do all that shit. Oh, oh, you so, should be oh, like, oh, wow. You ain't you doing the shit yeah. while nigga being back. You weren't doing that. Hell no. Look oh, at okay. how I sound. Yeah. Pause. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, I'm saying, that's how they have to jump over that motherfucker. So you probably could have went further, but you like, I ain't get no, to No, I the... couldn't get that way. Like, oh. <laughs> I tried to do the shit, but it's like, no, nah, man. I Because I knew I run, yeah. and then I jump, and I kick this foot over, uh -huh. and then I'm kicking this foot over, <laughs> and I'm over there. And I could do that to like up to like six feet. Wow. Damn. Yeah. But once you got up past that, they could, had me. You they, know what I mean? Yeah, they miss you with that yeah, yeah. So was, look, I'm, is that shit like, do they talk shit in that sport? Nah, man. I guess maybe if you good, but... <laughs> <laughs> Nigga ain't finna come trash yeah. talk you and shit. Nobody was seeing me in my <laughs> county. You know, I won like the county shit, but it's when you go to state and these niggas like, oh, nigga, y'all... <laughs> You got real shoes. <laughs> I'm doing my shit in Air Max. Like, oh, wow. these niggas got track shoes. <laughs> these niggas got track shoes, scholarships, and all that type of shit. You got badges, the badge, and everything. Like, Damn, oh, bro. Already you just a hood nigga. Get out, smoke your blunt, go jump. Yeah, I was smoke. I was smoke. <laughs> Not like that, like that. Okay, you, you so, taking you know, it easy. Little, yeah. <laughs> But I, track was the best shit. I wish I would have did it more. Because I was like, oh, man, hold on. You just get to go to other schools in the springtime. The girls in short That shorts. is, oh, my God. It's something for everybody. Niggas. If you big, go throw this. If you throw the discus. If you can run, run. If you can't run fast, can you run a long, a long time? time. <laughs> right. Run your ass for a while. Can you jog? All right, we got something for you. What you want to do? You want to jump? Can you jump far? Can you jump? It's something. Real. Bro, you would be surprised how many fat marathon runners it is, though. Because <laughs> they don't have to sprint. You just find your pace. Ain't saying how long you got to, how fast you got to do the shit. Yeah. You ain't going to see no fat sprinter. But you could you could see some yeah, fat marathon distance, yeah, runners. For sure. For sure. For sure. Okay, so you don't think you'd be a fat sprinter? Look at the NFL. Like, think about some of them dudes are big as fuck. Yeah, but they Man, just doing like, that for 40 yards. Mm -hmm. I'm not seeing them niggas do that shit like yeah, right. well, indoor tracks like 60. 60? Yeah, 60. Yeah, okay. They can do indoor track. But if they have to keep doing that shit at that speed and weight. They ain't gonna be able to outdo the track people that just go. Right. right. Yeah, like that's a quick that, come that, on, Marcel. Extra, gonna, extra yeah. cardio type your of Your bill gonna come shape. into play. Yeah. Right. So do you watch the sport though? That shit boring to watch on TV though, ain't it? Isn't it? No, I don't watch that shit. Oh, that's what I was gonna say. <laughs> I thought you were saying no, it's not boring. I, I mean, I watch it with the Olympics, no offense to none of the track people. I yeah. watch your girl, you know, when we got somebody from Coco. That's tennis. <laughs> oh, that's tennis. I hey, no, well, excuse me. They, I just found out about Coco, and I'm fucking with a heavy. I fuck with a heavy. Yeah, too. okay, okay, okay. But Coco, who you yeah. talking about? Richardson. You put me on. Car, yeah, there we Richardson. go. Oh Car, hell yeah, yeah. yeah. nigga! And she wore her natural hair. Her lat. Oh mm, boy. Yeah. Women don't understand <laughs> that little confidence do something to a nigga. And I never liked how they did her, bro. That'll yeah, make, like how me, they did that'll make me watch your sport. About the weed thing, yeah. about oh, yeah. all that. I never liked how they did it with how they talked about her mind. The, the thing crazy. happened. Like, first of all, if she smoked weed, she need an extra metal. <laughs> you you high and you still did that? <laughs> you need an extra metal. Like, we acting like weed is a performance enhancer. No, yeah, fam. Yeah. That shit should hinder you. That's like a bitch smoking a Newport. And then running the fastest time she ever fucking ran. Man, as soon as the match over, that bitch strike that Newport. Get her a Newport deal. <laughs> yo, 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 yo.
know what time it is. Time for broken play. And you know what we rocking with? Prize picks. Look, man, anything you put up to $100, they gonna match it. And it's the best time to be on prize picks when you're using the code broken play. Listen, you got baseball season in. You got WNBA. You got college football. You got NFL. Tennis. It's so many things that you... Okay, you don't like basketball. Okay, you like football. Any sport that you into, you can type it in. Come on, man. It's easy money. All you're doing is more or less. Who you like? If you like some of your favorite players and you think they're going to get more, pick more. If you think they're going to do less, pick less. Man, up to six picks, you can win up to 25 times your money. Over here at Broken Play, we've been winning money. We've been popping 1942. We've been having Fiji water. We've been having hot weed and platters. And you know why? Because we on prize picks. You could be on there too if you use the Broken Play code. And it's going to match up the money. If you put up $100, they match your $100. Now you got $200. Look, I ain't no math teacher. I ain't, I ain't do too good in algebra. But I know that's a good that's a good math right now. Hey, come on over there to Broken Play. Prize picks. Get at them. <laughs> what you going to tell that's me? That's when you getting the money and the endorsements in your sport. People don't realize that. Imagine a motherfucker running with a Newport label on the back of their damn shirt. <laughs> With one in their ear. Yeah. As soon as <laughs> they hit that and bitch. And that bitch don't fall. And you strike that bitch as in As soon as you cross the finish line. <laughs> that one, you got to take that shit serious. Man, Clay on. we've been talking about uh, Dion a lot lately, man. Mm -hmm. Dion has shook college football. Uh, he making the shit fun and exciting. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Nigga, yeah. I, I could honestly sit here and say I've never seen Colorado play live. Like, me watching a game, Facts, ever. I've never ever. until D... I have watched three Colorado <laughs> games. <laughs> One of which I was up to 2.30 in the morning Crazy. on the East Coast time. Yes. Just, and I'm watching. Locked I'm in. believing. I don't even... I don't even be... Like, this ain't even my region. A buffalo? <laughs> Nigga, I've been to Colorado two times my whole life. And one time was a layover. I ain't even get <laughs> I ain't even get to see the city. But nigga, I wanna be a part of that atmosphere. I mean, he he one of the biggest athlete entertainers that ever. we ever had. Yeah, icon, ever. bro. Where's yeah, icon. That we ever had. Yeah, icon. So I don't know why people is surprised by what he. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And you know, everybody coming out the woodworks and want to talk down about, you know, oh, well, he was supposed to stay at the HBC. Dog, this is Dion. Dion has to do whatever he does at the highest level. He right. trying to compete at the top. Like, this ain't it. Yeah. We know oh, Colorado yeah. ain't it. Yeah, Colorado. Sooner or later, you ain't got to worry about us watching right. another Colorado game. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I, I, I ain't saying that. <laughs> not, not yet. Yeah. We done. Why Dion when Shador gone. Yeah. Nah, when, he going to be there longer. Yeah, Dion going to stay past like Shador. Four, four years. Oh, you don't think he's... <laughs> but he going he gonna, to he gonna try to do something in anything he in. And so, like, I hear people talking about, well, what about the HBCUs? I don't think it was supposed to stop. Somebody else supposed to step in. Right. Mm -hmm. Who else got a name? That played in the NFL. Right. Yeah, that Tennessee that State right bring. Now. Yeah, that's hey, what I'm George. saying. Like, uh -huh. but it's got, you got to have the the. the what but you, you know what? It, it, it it's not just that, Clay. And a lot of people don't realize that they want to, uh, you know, crucify Dion for leaving. But it got to be more players willing to go to them HBCUs as well. Just like Travis Hunter did yeah. that. We need more right. players doing it so it could be exciting. Right. I don't want to watch no nigga who gonna end up fixing air conditions. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, bro. I'm saying I want to see niggas who I might see at the next level. <laughs> hey, we had NFL players from HBCU. Yeah, we they did. have been the great yeah, ones. Jerry Rice, yeah. uh, Walter Payne. Yeah. Uh, Strahan. McNair, uh, right? Yeah. Nah, yeah. Nah, nah. McNair uh, went to uh, Syracuse. No. Oh, uh, what's my Michael name? Michael Strahan. Michael Strahan. Uh, you got your boy. Uh, damn, what's my uh, what's the boy? Terrell Owens. Terrell. Yeah. No, he went to Tennessee Chattanooga. Shit, that's HBCU enough, goddammit. <laughs> <laughs> hey, ain't too many niggas going. <laughs> if, you, if you go there, you a nigga. <laughs> if you make it out that bitch, you really a nigga. <laughs> nah, but for real though. But it's just like Dion, bro. It's like how he motivate players. Yeah. 
Not just player, man. He can motivate a grown nigga. I be watching that <laughs> shit like, shit, I need to get my shit right. Together, yeah. Mm -hmm. Nigga, when his first press conference, when he coming and telling niggas, I'm here? Yeah. Coach, I just met you. Right. He let niggas know that you might as well find you something to do. <laughs> but he could have used some of them niggas he probably sent away <laughs> against Oregon. Oh, man. It was a it was a big, big, big old sensitive offensive lineman. <laughs> What he Got say? his feelings hurt the first day, and they needed that nigga. Man. <laughs> they needed that nigga. He could block his ass off, but that nigga just, you can't talk rough to him. <laughs> football ain't, football ain't hey. your sport if you can't do that. That's what I'm saying, but you got, that's the people that go to the league. Remember Buddy said they was hazing him? Yeah. And they were taking his money and making him pay for shit. He wanted them off like everybody ain't. Right. But this is the thing, though. It's getting so where they got cameras everywhere. Everybody got the social media and doing that type of shit. But if they was around when my high school coaches and middle school coaches were talking to you, Ran man, them, by nigg face mask. them niggas, them niggas would be locked up to this right. day. Right. You seen them choke slam? Yeah, playing. we thought we thought that was you supposed <laughs> to get. Oh shit, Coach Cloud finna knock my ass out when I come to the <laughs> sideline. That nigga be looking at you. Another false start. Come on, let me talk to you, Green. <laughs> you seen that nigga they just, ain't say a word when just, I got over uh, there. They Hit you hard the as hell with coach, the pads on. You seen the maze coach punch the nigga in the stomach. Yeah, punched him in the stomach. That's crazy, though. I never N seen that. Now, now it's crazy. <laughs> no, even, like, even growing up, I never seen punching. Like, that's wild. I, I can see he smacked in the helmet, but punching a player in the stomach, that's crazy. You never know how that coach feeling. Yeah, them coaches. <laughs> I seen the coach kick a nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Kicked him in the ass. <laughs> Get your ass oh, yeah, I seen oh, that. Oh, my God. Oh, yeah, but no, that. it connected. Like, the nigga wasn't moving yet. <laughs> hey, the worst thing, a nigga kneeling, go come by and bap your ass, you fall. You know you already wobbling and shit. And nigga ain't got no damn balance. But no, nah, that would have got to get back to, man. Coaches talking shit to players. That's why these players be soft as fuck yeah. on the field sometimes. Now, I'm not saying all, but some of them, like. Because the mental a big part of it. And if you can't take that shit, then, yeah. shit, what else you ain't going to be able to tell? You ain't going to take it when they talking about you in these goddamn stands. Right. You ain't going to take it when they, they got a sign that's saying some fucked up shit about <laughs> your mama. Boy, you ain't see that sign they oh, had. that's uh, disrespectful. Man, man that Oregon gonna... sign, man, they, now that's out of line. We not even going to speak on it, but nigga, you fucked up for that, that's nigga. Foul. And we gonna that's start fine. coming to Oregon game with signs, nigga. Wait till we find out about your fucking coach, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> nigga, I took, I was like, but you know, you know what's so, even more racist, though? That the media put that out. They want that shit yeah, to hit. Yeah. yeah. Right. Oh, well, right. you seen the tweets now. Like, they happy. They so happy he lost, bro. Oh, yeah, nigga, right. they love it. They couldn't wait. Oh, nigga, them This would have happened if he lost the first game, though. Oh, nigga, them all white group chats going crazy right now. Yeah, them proud And when boys. I say all white, I'm talking about Nick Saban. Uh, goddamn. Uh, uh, he so love the Nick Saban. Right. Who? Dion. Yeah, that's just how they do the Alphalac commercial. <laughs> it's in the contract? Yeah, it's in the contract. He don't yeah, fuck he with that on nigga. His ass. He don't fuck with that nigga. They was, <laughs> he found out he was talking about him, too. It's him, goddamn. What's the Clemson coach? Dabo. 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 Sweeney, yeah. They, they got about six goddamn niggas in the group chat, and they talking cash shit. We got him. Go give me my money. <laughs> Pay <laughs> <He>? me. <laughs> Them niggas better with Oregon. Them niggas put the eyes on Oregon. Facts. But Oregon was supposed to beat them on paper. Yeah, yeah. Bro, they not yeah. they wasn't ready for yeah. Oregon. We knew it's just the blacks and us like, boy, I like Dion. We, Ain't no damn right. way Dion lose right. by 21. Hey man, we out here. We I was one of them folks. Yeah, hey nigga, yeah. you couldn't tell me. I said, oh, they got too much pride. Dion, yeah. Dion to suit up before he let them <laughs> bitches lose. We rocking with, with the underdog. We out there looking. This Coach Carter. This, yeah. you know what I'm saying? This hey, <laughs> Dion, the movie. Dion didn't have no artists to bring them boys out though in Oregon though. It's a away game. Still. Dion, you got to bring that shit everywhere yeah, I ain't, you go. I ain't see nobody on the sideline. Yeah, man. nigga. Y'all ain't. Away game. It's he like probably you niggas want, knew. Do, 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 that, do Big Boy Son still go to Oregon? Nah, he, he trained. He gone? Where okay. he at now? Uh, Nevada. Okay. Both oh, shit. Damn. I ain't gonna never see him. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't watching no goddamn. Hey, but nah, bro. I think we we came from a great era of sports that they done stopped. When the last time you seen a basketball fight? Niggas don't fight no more. You remember Chris Paul and Brandon Ingram and them? That was the last one. And that was a good one. No, Isaiah Stewart and No, nah, they ain't let him fight. fight. That they ain't let him fight. Right. Shit, that nigga had to fight himself. <laughs> <laughs> they couldn't hold that big motherfucker back, boy. 
But no, nah, it gotta get back to that. When we bro, when we were watching sports, it'll be at least one or two basketball fights a month. You could go through a whole season and see one fight. And it don't be shit. Yeah, they not they not ain't hey, motherfuckers ain't scrapping. Nigga just These talking. Mo- look, yeah. think about this. Think about this. Yeah. Twitter. Yeah. So so right. think about this. Motherfuckers before had to have a little playground in them, right? Uh-huh. Niggas wasn't just hooping in the gym. That shit is shit that gonna happen when you hooping Outside, around in your yeah. community and yeah. fuck around like that. These motherfuckers be straight with the trainer from seven years. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, and you ain't never a nigga foul you too hard. Like, that's man, very true. That's very true. Yeah, man, you you, you kind of aggressive. Yeah, <laughs> bitch, yeah. we playing basketball. <laughs> The fuck? <laughs> and the nigga acting like it wrestling. I'm going to go right and you go left. No, nigga, I'm going to go right too, bitch. Because I to get past yeah, me. Yeah, that, why you playing so hard? Why, why? Hey, what? that's what I spoke. Hey, now, I'm going to tell you who's, who's a dirty motherfucker. When you just mentioned playing hard, that damn Miami Dolphins coach. Oh, Mike McDaniel? Them nigga put up 70 points. <laughs> Doggish. Nigga, I wouldn't shake your... B- get the fuck out my face, nigga. <laughs> hey, but they... Why, you what? trying to get me fired, bitch. <laughs> you put up... Hey, that nigga grabbed that nigga. Yeah, you trying to embarrass me? You fuck, nigga. You trying to embarrass me? Motherfucker, what have I ever done to you, bitch? <laughs> hey, I don't know what I did to you, but, hey. They, uh, they stopped from breaking the record. They could have broke the record. No, he... Mike, yeah, yeah. He could have kicked the field goal. He chose not to. Fuck that. Is that better or worse? I, I would have broke. I would have broke. Hey, I think I would have ran the scoreboard yes. up on their ass. Because he already did. You did. You seen what the receiver points. said? What? He was like, "Shit, I want us to score a hundred. He was like, "I was mad we didn't get a hundred. Damn. What's his name? Robbie Chosen, who played for the uh, oh, he played changed for the his name. He changed his name. Yeah, his last name was uh, I forgot, but he played with the Panthers. He Anderson, was Anderson, Anderson, Robbie yeah. Anderson. Okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. he played for. Them too? Mm-hmm. Yeah, he oh, scored. God. I didn't know yeah. he's still in the league. Shit, nigga, 70 points. A lot of niggas scored. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, everybody should have scored with that. that you get a touchdown. Like a yeah, bro, yeah, yeah. Whoever they said won. the backup was throwing TDs. Bro, right. this is my thing. They said the backup do like a long ass TD or some shit. So, hey, so, uh, go. That, you know how answer. niggas talk shit? Niggas will use that. Like, you know what I could have did to your bitch ass now? All right. All right, well, next right, time. Now, I let you live. Hey, look, <laughs> next time I'm going to kick that motherfucker. That's all he got to say. Nigga, know what you talking about. It was like eight minutes left in the score, 70 to 20, so they could have easily ran it up. Oh. Uh, break the record. I would have got at least one more. Man, You're going to see one more, and it's going to be impressive. I would have got two more. <laughs> A bomb. It's going to be impressive. <laughs> hey, <laughs> oh. three, three, 30 seconds left. I'm doing a trick play. <laughs> <laughs> Nigga, I'm doing a fullback double pass slant. Double reverse. <laughs> double reverse. Ah, nigga... I'll make a bitch go get a pistol. This nigga, <laughs> this nigga that brought back the Wildcat. Yeah. <laughs> Niggas oh, go, shoot me, fuck, <laughs> nigga. It was a meme. They had a, a guy in the stands dressed up as Mike McDaniels like, hey, man, you want to call a play? Put it, put it playing yourself. It was, it was pretty funny. Talking about he was dressed like Mike yeah, McDaniel. Like Mike, Mike McDaniel, he a real nerd too, bro. Oh, you saw that uh, when he used to be a ball boy for Denver? Yeah. Oh, oh that's it. So that shit so probably personal. personal. Yeah. He from Colorado. Oh, he feel like Dion. It's personal. Yeah. It's Tua personal. took that personal. Why would Tua this take personal? This whole year he's taking shit personal. Man, they told him nigga he'd be out the league. Tua. Oh, they be do, they do be talking shit about yeah. Tua. Tua cold, bro. Tua nice, bro. Damn. Mm-hmm. Mm, that's tough. Who's some of your favorite basketball players right now in the league? Cause you fuck with basketball more than football. Yeah, right? I mean, you know, I fuck with the Warriors. I'm trying to see what the motherfuckers gonna do. I want. I'm so sorry about Jordan Poole. That nigga got. He's nice, bro. <laughs> hit in the face. And what was you doing, bro? Well, I take we did see a fight. That was that was a good one too. <laughs> that nigga just we didn't fight back. To see it. We yeah, weren't we supposed to see it. We weren't supposed to see that. <laughs> I think Draymond leaked that bitch himself. Right. That nigga probably watching it. Oh man, this shit got to hit the media. I yeah. knocked Buddy shit loose. Man, shit. I don't know, man. I just... The Hawks, I want to see what we going to do. We got to get this shit together. A Trey going to get gone. Please. And, I, and, I, and Trey going to go somewhere and go the fuck yes. off. You already know he is. You already know. Yes. They just won't put niggas like, bro, Atlanta... Why we didn't follow up that season? When we went to, to the, the goddamn... Conference final. Yeah, yeah. Niggas get happy off that. And then when I say niggas, I'm talking about they front office. Like, we good. 
No, bitch, yeah, we need more. Yeah, they think they trajectory. Yeah. Say, we they made feel, it now, in the next two years, we're going to be. No, nah, yeah, they, they weren't like supposed that. to be you, there. If, if they, oh, they, yeah, you they didn't get better. Then, that's that's year, when you like, oh, we got to. If the good teams are getting better, nigga, why y'all think y'all shouldn't be doing more in the front office? What do they need? Nigga, a lot. Some, uh, a two guard <laughs> that can shoot, bro. Ah. Shoot, they need shooters, bro. DeJounte yeah. Murray is not a shooter, bro. I love DeJounte, but come on, man. He yeah. ain't a shooter. They got rid of Kevin Herter. They gave Bogey that same off. money. Yeah, he, Kevin right. Herter going crazy With now. the Kings yeah. right now. Yeah, like. You watch WNBA? <laughs> Nigga. I, I don't want to say no. Okay, but, but look, don't. you don't have to. I'm going to tell you this, though. I don't. WNBA is really interested, though. I, I, I slept on it. Dom convinced me, bro. Like, it's certain players you got to look for. Who I need to look for? Wilson with the Aces. Asian I like Wilson, her. Wilson, Brianna Stewart. Yeah, it's a, I've Gray. heard all these names, but I, okay. Yeah, but I'm saying like now me just watching. I ain't tried to buy no tickets to go watch it live though. But like I go watch. I'm gonna go watch Isaiah Wilson. That's the name Howard. for the uh, dream. No, shit. How the Hawks looking? They need to get her. So, so what what we looking for in the WNBA? They got it, hoopers, bro. They just okay. So it's skill. It's, it's skill. It's, 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 more, it's, more, skill. it's more. It's more. It's more. We go. We go. I'm gonna get some. Handles. Oh yeah, yeah. some of them. Yeah, some uh-huh. ankles broken. It's, some shoot, it's some, a bunch of shooters yeah, out hey, there. Some, some nice step throughs. Some it's some goddamn. Some pulling up. I just wanna like they gotta have them mic'd up. I wanna hear how them females talk shit. You know how niggas talk shit. Oh, they talk shit. I want they females like, oh bitch, you thought, oh bitch, yeah. you got the right one. <laughs> yeah, they talk shit out there. Ski, yeah. Oh, they don't mic them. <laughs> huh? They don't mic them. I want to see that shit. Yeah, yeah. That's they don't what, mic them. Well, be I think they got a mic them, man. I want to hear that. I gotta shit, be a man. part of WNBA marketing. I get them on that same level yes. of getting money as NBA. Yes. Like for real, you just gotta convince them like this gonna work. Bitch, I'm Michael scoring Mike. and I got cramps. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I ain't supposed to be out here right now. <laughs> hey. <laughs> period, bitch. <laughs> On my period. <laughs> On my period, bitch. Period, bitch. <laughs> Man, nigga, uh, be watching the fuck out that game. Hey, we love that shit, And we'll start looking at our old ladies different. Bitch, if she could score 38 points, bitch, I, you ain't gonna lay in the bed right. all day. <laughs> Get your motherfucking ass up. Get your ass up. You need to put up a few buckets, bitch. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. You get in there and cook some now, bitch. If she could score 38, 8, and 7, and that's her first day on her right. cycle, bitch. You, right. you coming right. off. Get your ass up. <laughs> Uh, uh, no, we want to hear that shit talking though, man. When the camera coming, they holding their pants. <laughs> <laughs> Beat the blood out that bitch. God. <laughs> <laughs> you stupid. Damn, Bro. man. Y'all crazy. Nah, but I will check it out at WNBA. I you remember when it from. first came out. I literally remember that. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. I remember. That's uh, around time with Lisa Leslie. Yeah, Sammy I remember. Cooper, Cheryl Swoop. She went for a Mika. dunk in that first game. And she got hung. She missed. Yeah. Yeah. Don yeah. Staley. But uh, it's going to get better because the yelling. girls is getting better in college. College, in college yeah. College, yeah. It's crazy, right? Oh, you, girl, Re- Angel Reese, when she get in the league, Angel I know she going to take that shit. It said she projected to go to the Dream. Like, Paige, Paige Beckers, Caitlin Clark. Okay, like yeah. Them, Haley Van Yeah, Lee. they had a lot of tension uh, with the NCAA tournament. Yeah. yeah, that game was a lot of people watching So that. how much is the dunking effect? We not going to talk about this? It, it, like, it affects I mean, I know it gets brought up, like, but... It, Man, put the goal on eight feet. Nah. Let them do they, they see it as they, they get mad if you say that. Yeah, they they don't want to hear that. What shit? <laughs> what if they just put it on nine and a half and don't tell them? <laughs> and then she just put, get a put back. Like, oh, <laughs> <laughs> like, they don't never want to go back. Yeah. They don't never want to go back. They don't never want to go back. But you can't, like, And they yeah. do a press conference. I'm sorry. I know we had, <laughs> a, we had an unheard of 33 dunks this game, but... We didn't know that the, <laughs> the goal was on nine feet. Yeah, yeah. And now all the players, they're agreeing to keep it on nine feet. <laughs> we going to see shit, see bro. See alley oops and all Come that on, shit. man. Off the glass? Because they got the skill to do. All right. All right. Hey, Clayton, did you see when uh, Aaron Rodgers got hurt the first game, though? No, I ain't see it. Yeah, man. Yeah. So the Jets, they was uh, a lot of people in here. <laughs> 
was saying Jets was going to be Super Bowl bound. Oh, Who said yeah. that? <laughs> no one said that. I don't know if anybody said no Super said Bowl bound, but we said You nigga, damn near. What you did they say? <laughs> hey, I'm in, so I was like, bro, they in a tough division. Oh, nigga, you just don't know. You don't know shit. I said, okay. That's all they did. They had a quarterback, bro. But Zach he, Wilson don't give a he fuck. He fucking it up. Oh, man, he don't oh. give a fuck. <laughs> he told him too. They were like, man, what are you? Bitch, I ain't even supposed to be here. <laughs> you niggas didn't want me. Bro, he's so bad. I seen niggas talking about, let's go get Andrew Luck. That's nasty. And that man, he been tired. retired eight years. <laughs> That's crazy. Man, Andrew Luck, bro, like, hey, don't bring me in this shit. <laughs> bro, Andrew Luck, out of shape. Andrew Luck I always looked confused even when he was good, though. He was like, bro. Yeah, that. That, that Eli Manning look. Yeah, yeah. That's Eli crazy Luck. that you that bad that they looking at people that ain't even play. Nigga, you know it's bad. Guess who else they looking at? Them niggas text Colin Kaepernick. They said, hey, nigga, we won't do the pledge. We, <laughs> we might. <laughs> we want to try you out. <laughs> Shit. This nigga horrible, nigga. This nigga uh, is horrible. Uh, hey, the nigga uh, I was seeing the other day, um, what's that, uh, in basketball, uh, when they lost in the... Um, what they lost in? They lost to Germany, I think. Uh, USA. FIBA, yeah. Yeah, yeah. they lost. So and we was, Canada. And they lost to Canada too mm-hmm. in the uh, in the third place game. Who play? So Clay, when you played basketball, what position you played? I played AAU and shit. My team was shit. Oh. What the fuck, Dad wrote this for then? No, but look, <coughs> they always try to put you when you tall <coughs> at tall position. <laughs> And I wasn't doing no tall position shit. I'm six two, six three, but it's nigga, a guard, don't put it's me. a guard size, like exactly. Yeah. But nigga, when you on them teams, they like, okay, you got the center. No, I don't, man. This motherfucker is six nine. <laughs> hey, Clay, that nigga I'm doing. I'm down there. This nigga is. That nigga doing a highlight tape on your ass, bro. <laughs> that nigga, that nigga probably call. Hey, we need to get a cameraman here tonight. I'm going for 40. <laughs> but I'll be the only nigga with heart. Like, yeah, yeah. Just, like, be... like I'll guard the nigga. But sometimes heart. But it's like, get... what the fuck? <laughs> but also, it's like, nigga, I can't even do the shit I've been working on, nigga. All I can do is cross niggas, nigga. I like Benny Hardaway, nigga. I'm trying to, man, give me this shit. Let me shoot this hoe. <laughs> nigga, I go I out do. to the three. Hey, what you doing out there? <laughs> nigga, shut the fuck up. <laughs> Trying to get us back in the game some kind of way, my nigga. Clay. We going nigga, all over, getting stomped. A nigga ain't never put you on a poster, though, have you? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> no hesitation. Yeah. I thought when you said you had No, because I wouldn't get out the way. Man, fuck that. Yeah. I'd block your shit, bro. I'm gone. I don't care. That's the game, right? <laughs> nigga, I, like- I used to good. Like I said, I could jump high as fuck. I used to good yell. Yeah, yeah, I couldn't palm the bitch, so I had to cuff it. Uh-huh. So I had to get extra high. Oh. I stopped dunking like that. Nigga undercut me one time. I did no, a no. full flip, landed on my back. And this wasn't even no real game, my nigga. I was just like, hey, bro. Now, right. that nigga had heart. That nigga said, that nigga got me fucked up, bitch. He oh, put on me. <laughs> bro. Undercut me, man. I said. That's scary as hell. Yeah. Because you in the air for the longest. So anytime like a putback, that's all you. You mm-hmm. fucking with the putback dunk. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Shit oh, yeah. Like that. Tip, the first oh, time oops. I- the first time I dunked, it was because I got hung on the rim and I pushed that bitch over. What grade were you in? <laughs> like eight. Damn. Yo, with the busy fall season already in swing, you might be looking for wholesome, convenient meals for jam-packed days. Back, America's number one ready-to-eat meal kit can help you fuel up fast with chef-prepared, dietitian-approved, ready-to-eat meals delivered straight to your door. That means you're not spending extra money, sitting down thinking, oh, what I'm going to eat, what I'm going to do, what I'm... Hey, it's already there. It was at your door. You'll save time, you'll eat well, and stay on track. I think that's the biggest part when you're trying to be healthy. Sometimes you need something quick and convenient. When you're hungry, you already got it at your door. Man, it's nutritional quality. Man, the flavor. Now you talking. Because sometimes food be healthy, but it ain't got no flavor in it. This food is flavored. All you got to do is eat and enjoy. This September, get factor and enjoy eating well without the hassle. Simply choose your meals and enjoy fresh, flavor-packed meals. Delivered to the door. Ready in just two minutes. No prep, no mess. What you waiting for? Head to factormeals.com slash 85sports50. 
and use code 85 Sport 50 to get 50% off. What you got to lose, man? That's code 85 Sport 50 at factormills.com. Slash 85 Sport. Bro, I remember, bro, I'll never Sheesh. forget. Uh, a nigga I went to school with, Gunny Lawal. We was in uh, oh, middle school. You went to school, school. Gunny? Yeah, Gunny. I played went, against Gunny in high school. He went to uh, Georgia Tech. Uh, North Cross and Georgia North Tech. Cross, yeah. He so played for Phoenix. Man. North Clay Middle, we, you know, I come from where you could play you could play basketball before school started in the morning. Oh, yeah. yeah same. Yeah. So, we in the yeah, old gym. Yeah, you had, yeah. We in the old gym. Yeah, you played our dog. ass off. So the nigga stands. Gunny, bro, Gunny dunked that morning in eighth grade. Bro, everybody talked about it in school all day. I was like, bro, I got a dunk. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> so my whole goal by the time ninth grade hit, I could at least be touching the damn nets. You wait a minute, net? Yeah. Okay, yeah, how tall was you? Nigga, you gotta think. I only grew four inches since middle school. I probably was like five, five feet. Okay, so yeah, okay. I got Nigga, you. I just knew every I knew everybody was supposed to have a growth spurt. I right. knew, I just didn't know when mine was coming. Bitch, it didn't come. <laughs> <laughs> you ain't never look at the little man, you ain't never look at like Muggsy and, and Spud. I thought you talking yeah. about the movie. <laughs> no. <laughs> bro, I never, I never been a goddamn, I never been a fan of 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 little niggas. I never looked at <laughs> <laughs> look, I, it, it coming off wrong. <laughs> yeah, I never looked and be like, see, I need to go for him because he remind me of my. No. I mean, nigga. did you respect him? Like, okay. Nah, I don't. <laughs> <laughs> nigga be like, man, did you see Spud? Man, fuck a Spud. Well, <laughs> bitch, give me Dominique Wilkins. I want to see nothing. I don't want no goddamn. Look how he did it. Man, fuck all that. Give a nigga who got. <laughs> Let me see a nigga who could keep doing it. <laughs> I want no nigga who did it. <laughs> <laughs> Bitch, keep doing it. Nate Robinson, all them niggas. I ain't give a fuck about them little ass niggas, man. <laughs> this is the funniest shit I heard. <laughs> Bro, because they be, people Bro. be want you to feel. Okay, okay, so. So that's the opposite of me. Like, I like the players that's closest to me. Like, I wasn't no. Big nigga, I wasn't no strong nigga, so that's why I'm looking at like Penny. I'm looking at Reggie Miller. I'm like, oh, oh this okay, motherfucker okay. can throw up all these points. Like, okay, yeah, because that's my body type. That's the shit that was close to me. You know what I'm saying? And yeah. I wasn't big as them niggas, no way. But yeah. but you still saw that in you, yeah. Yeah. But, no, I don't know. It just like but you you didn't. <laughs> yeah, because people be feeling like uh they compare you when you see a certain height, a certain... Like, nigga, just expect me. I know you like Michael Strayland. Why, bitch? Because I got a gap. <laughs> <laughs> Niggas, of course, you liking a motherfucker because of your disability. Right. <laughs> disability is... I'm trying to imagine you try to jump up and, like, touch the, touch the net. It's pretty funny. Yeah, in, in eighth grade, that shit was crazy. See, bro, I know when a nigga can't really play when they be like, oh, no, I got defense. Nigga, you, right. you right. fouling, nigga. Right. You finna foul all fucking day. I'm gonna play defense. <laughs> nigga, we gotta play both. <laughs> if I pass you the ball, catch it and pass it back. What right. the fuck? Bitch, this ain't football. Nigga's hands go up. Uh, I just play defense, nigga. No. <laughs> you got any uh, funny uh, track stories when you uh, out there with track and field? Man, we just used to jump all day. That shit was For real? Shit. Man, that shit was shit talking. Yeah, because you out there all nigga. day. My cousin yeah. used to run track. We oh, used to go to the meet. Man. All day? You out there all Bruh, day. Bruh, you go to the meet. That shit early as fuck in the morning if you leave it from the school. Uh, if you ain't driving, if you riding with them motherfuckers, you leaving early as fuck. All day, bro. Get to that bitch. And I'm talking about you'd have been there for a few hours by the time it's 10. Yeah. And then you still gonna be there. Because yeah, your up. event don't start until like and then three or four hours. Later. If you're winning, and yeah, hey, if and, ain't and, nobody and, winning, y'all might go the fuck home. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> ain't no reason for y'all to be here. Hey, no more. Was your parents supportive? Hell no. Yeah, they weren't coming to this shit. <laughs> <laughs> they, I, know, I mean, they came to a few, but yeah, it's like, I know as a dad, like I would start like, bro, my youngest daughter, she three, so her mom done put her in soccer, so. <laughs> But at this age, they don't have any games at that, so it's just practices. Nigga, they okay. are trying to fuck out of my daughter, bro. Kick the ball to the cone. They kick the ball. Don't use no hands. Okay, that type of shit. Understand that shit. Bro, 
That's probably three minutes out of the whole practice. The rest of the practice, the motherfucker playing red light, green light. <laughs> Shut up. When I say, because st- they trying to get them to, I guess, lit- I don't know. But long story short, I think I done did my last two practices. I'm not going back out there. <laughs> you gonna have to. You gonna have to get, do the individual because that sounds like they just trying to get. They just getting money. Money. money grab. How old is this? Hey, but no, they three and four. But I ain't gonna lie, my little girl be fresh as fuck. She be having the goddamn <clears throat> socks on her soccer cleats out there, knowing she about to play red light, green light. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't have to buy none of that shit, bro. She is red light, green light in her ass up. <laughs> we we finna take her to practice one day. She said, Dad, don't forget the soccer ball. I'm like, shit, you ain't gonna need this motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> now what you about to do? <laughs> but she come on with a little water ball and a soccer. But that's what I'm saying. Like, she like it, it though. Yeah, she like it. That's why yeah, I ain't okay. tripping. But I don't like it, so I ain't gonna keep going out of her. Hey, yeah. when, to what age? Oh, you want shit. You playing red light, <laughs> green light. <laughs> <laughs> you playing red light, green light. No, I'm just playing. <laughs> oh. No. Mm-hmm. Make you faster. Oh, damn. Well, they say that. They say the, the sports that help the kids later, like soccer good because it build up conditioning mm-hmm. and the feel so big. Uh-huh. You know what I'm saying? You Other never, shit. like, in football, you know how you get breaks. You never get rid of a right, breaking soccer. Right, so you running the whole time. See, I come from, like, my dad, like, was a real nigga. Once we got to, once I got to high school, he knew I wasn't going to be shit. He stopped coming to the goddamn. You know how right. some parents would be like, why you quit? My dad right. understood. He was like, right. shit, I feel I got it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, about that time. I was kind of like that with my parents. I was like, y'all going to come to, like, A-track meet? Like, come to one. This is like, you ain't got to... You ain't got to keep coming. <laughs> it's a lot for me. I didn't like being out there all that time. <laughs> so, yeah, I feel you. Man, you got a, you got a son. What, what's your son? What sports you would rather your son play, if any? Uh, Basketball. He like football, though. Dog. He really? love throwing it. He love catching it. I, I try to get him used to just catching shit. So, uh-huh. like, I throw it to him and I take it away quick. But I use, like, three different types of sports. Like, it'll be a football. Yeah. It's a basketball. Catch this but baseball. he likes sports, though. That's what's up. Oh, man, dog. This man really been watching this shit for a minute. Like, he was Damn. watching the playoffs and the finals with me when he was just born. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. So and he... so, like, he watched the game. And... Hey, and it's rare, though, because, like, a lot of kids, like, I ain't going to take away, because you know how we went outside and we would watch sports on TV. A lot of these kids don't sit down to watch a full game, though. Uh, he, it might not be the full game. No, I'm not, yeah, not talking about but him, but yeah. I'm talking about even when I was Damn. like 11, 12, like I would sit down and watch a game. Day, bro, right. my These little, kids not doing my it. My little brother, a D1 basketball player, you can't pay him to watch a basketball game. Like, For real? Right. He just, even niggas in the league, young niggas in the league, they ain't watching. Yeah, they, they so quick to watch the highlights. Like I see right. the highlights. Nigga, all we had was like ESPN growing up. These right. niggas watch highlights. On Instagram. Bro, I vividly remember game. I remember staying up to watch T Mac score 13 and 30 yep. seconds. I remember San all that. It would just else. be certain games and it feel different. And you'd be like, man, he doing something different right now. What yeah. the fuck? How many he finna put up? Like, nigga, hope I remember going crazy. Game. That Dame game. With- oh, yeah. I remember a game I stayed up late when I was in middle school. I, I want to say it was Tom Brady. Uh, not, not Tom Brady. Uh, Payne Manning against the Bucks. They were down, and they came back. It was some crazy shit. Like, they was down, like, they counted them out. The motherfuckers came back. That was one of my favorite teams. I used to like Marshall Falk. That nigga, him, and then when Edron oh. James came, fuck with Edge, too. Mm-hmm. That shit just was different then, man. Hey, you taking money over rings? Hell yes. <laughs> yes. Yes, like what? What money we talking about? So I'm saying, if you was if you was on the Warriors team, but but they you, you ain't y'all ain't won the championship yet, but y'all can win the championship next year, and y'all see it. Y'all had one more piece, but they want to keep you on the team, but they can't pay you like this sorry ass Orlando Magic could pay you. This this is what we said. We said fifty million in a ring with the Lakers or a hundred million no rings with the Magic. Did, did did you just say what I think you just said? 
50 million in one ring with the LA Lakers or 100 million in no ring with you the get Orlando. The 100 million, me and Mickey Mouse kicking it. Fuck are you talking about? That's what I said. Marcel. Are we confused? Uh, I'm, ta- about- I'm taking a ring, bro. First of all, 50 million yes. in, in LA in Florida. is 25 million. Exactly. If that. Plus, you be dealing with Hollywood women that's going to take more. The cost of living is more. It costs more to be there. Orlando, you are in Florida. It's a little bit cheaper. It ain't South Beach. It ain't, you know what I'm saying? It's Orlando. So comparatively to that, 100 million, 50 million ain't even feeling like 100. A motherfucker with 50 trying to figure out how to get 100. Clay, you saying that, but like you putting it in The ring don't matter, dog. Kevin Durant got a ring and y'all don't respect him. He got two of them, and y'all don't give a damn. Y'all treat him like, oh, he the worst motherfucker ever because he went and did what y'all said he was supposed to fucking do. I fuck with KD. I fuck with KD, too, but look at how the people how, play you him. You see how they portray him. You know him, what I'm yeah. saying? He went and got one, but he didn't get one the way. You can go get a ring, and you got the 50 million, but you didn't get the ring the way people wanted you to get the ring. So now they treat you like you ain't shit for getting the ring. So what's the point of getting the Give me my money. <laughs> give me my money. Run me my money. All 100 M's. Yeah, I Run say, me my I money. I 100 M's, too. Fuck it, that ring. Bruh. 100 M's in Orlando, I'm laid back like Shaq. Yeah, nigga. Do they treat, we don't, do they Robert, treat Robert, Robert Ory. We don't care about Ory. Bruce Bowen, nigga. Niggas Robert, don't be Robert talking Ory. about Robert Ory. He got seven of them bitches. Yes, he don't give a fuck, great. though. And that's but great. But he got respect. He got respect. Good. To a certain extent. So yes, right. Old nigga. So go to the bank Robert and you Ory. cash in your respect. <laughs> and you see how much they give you back. Robert Ory is good. He gonna, he gonna I mean, he's straight. He should he be, cool. but he is not. People love him, but, but he is, he, a, is he premier? Is he out there in the front? Is he highlighted? He's not a like, Hall of Famer, no. If, if you see the nigga walking in the Atlanta airport, do, will you see a stampede? No, I will say, no. hey, Robert, what's up, bro? You won't even say that. I you would say like, something, man. Tell somebody, be like, that was Robert Ory right there. <laughs> <laughs> and that's it, nigga. And they be like, I do that shit all right, the time. What right. the fuck Robert Ory doing playing <laughs> Frontier? <laughs> right. Dad, don't do him like that. <laughs> now, so, now, what are you picking? Who? What's I'm picking the ring. You going ring. ring. I'm going ring. Yeah. I'm going ring. The ring. I, I just Champion. feel like... Okay, but, uh, but you're, not, you're not the guy. That's cool. You're not even the guy next to the guy. You're not even third. I'll be the sixth man. Six man. That's the highest you could get. That's nasty. And what you think you're going to get with that respect of that ring as the sixth man? Another contract. You think you're going to show that ring to somebody? <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Bitch, that ain't yours. <laughs> That's LeBron shit, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> He rode that niggas back to the championship. <laughs> <laughs> Whoop de doo. <laughs> a whopping 3.8 points per game. You got a ring. Yeah. You niggas so, gonna be Darvin Ham. They gonna treat you crazy. They gonna treat you crazy, bro. Like, they do talk to you crazy. Like, it's cool, me. but like, I mean, amongst the people, like, outside of that team's fan base, I'm just saying, fam. Okay, so tell me this. Now, a nigga like Damian Lillard. He done got all that money. Would you? A nigga you can like go get him? a ring now. <laughs> can, huh? It's okay. You got. You can go get. Yeah, your he can go, go get, go a get ring. it because he's that. Because he's that guy. And you know he's good. He's that guy. Yeah, okay. He's that guy. If he wants to take a a a, a dip because he's made a good amount, you yeah. know what I'm saying. If he wow. want to take a little dip to get him a ring. By all means, do it, man. If that's what you want to do, he ain't even finna have to take a dip and, and getting paid. Though. Well, they then get paid and go. Yeah, yeah get paid and go get you rig. one. Yeah. I, ain't, I don't see nothing wrong with it. I guess it's different. It's all. I think it's another thing is where you at in your career. That's, whether yeah. you should do it, right? Because shit, fifty million. That's still a lot too, especially in shit. I ain't seen five. I ain't seen a million. <laughs> right. You talking about fifty of them motherfuckers at one time? Bitch, I have a heat stroke. But then look at a hundred. I'd be, I'd be so fucked. A hundred, I couldn't handle that, Clay. <laughs> hundred million. If fifty got you I, passing out, hey, what a hundred gonna do? Have me like Lamar Odom. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, bitch, you gonna find me in a brothel <laughs> after every game? Hey man, he's all hopped up on cocaine and dick pills. <laughs> This motherfucker had Mountain Dew all around his mouth. <laughs> <laughs> Every game, my basketball show hard as a motherfucker. <laughs> I can't even dunk. I'm full of dick pills. <laughs> man, you missed the dunk, bitch. I mean, I'm so fucked up. I'm on that rhino. All the blood, all the blood ran out my fingers. <laughs> Couldn't catch the pass. <laughs> They got honey packs in the locker room. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Yeah. Nigga, yeah. nigga over there with a hundred bucks <laughs> when they did Gatorade. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, at a timeout, during the timeout. Hey. What was that? What was that? He just put in the game right? Hey, don't worry about it. <laughs> hey, bitch, move that camera. <laughs> hey, Clay, when we talk about this, it just made me think about it. I got to ask you this. Did you watch Winning Time? I did. I started, like, the first episode, but I never was able to... Uh, Bro, it actually was a good show, it. but it got canceled uh, after two seasons, you know, with the yeah, writer's strike yeah, and all that yeah. shit. So, bro, they said Magic Johnson was fucking doing halftime. I heard that. Like a... Bro, I never... Well, they had a club. Yeah. yeah they had a club the at the club. stadium. Forum. Like, yeah, like, that's crazy. Bro, like after, in the 80s. And afterwards, they going. Oh, Like, yeah. it ain't like it's just some shit that's here and nobody... Like, no, we go... Man. We just put on a great show, and we better be in there with some... With the baddies. And the baddies. The baddies. And singers. Yeah. Because the owner was on bullshit, too, though. Right. Yeah. Jerry Bus yeah. was on bullshit. He Bro, this is what I'm saying. Like, you know how, like, when... When we're growing up, we don't know certain things and why certain things the way they are. You hear about Showtime and L.A., L.A. Showtime, mm -hmm. but we ain't understand. Well, I know I didn't understand I didn't it because around this time, I'm seeing Kobe and Shaq out there. I'm mm -hmm. like, this shit, you know, it don't look like they're doing much. <laughs> but I would have been a Lakers fan if I had known the era, how that Boston rivalry was. Yeah. I feel oh, yeah. like I should have went for the black team. Because the Lakers were the black team at the time. Yeah, that's mostly the team you would see on TV um, nationwide because the TV contracts was just happening mm -hmm. in the early 80s. So mm -hmm. you only see the Lakers in Boston on TV like that. Does that yeah. make sense? And they, and, they, and they say the NBA. Yeah. yeah. That rivalry say the NBA. The NBA that had a couple of them rivalries is needed. And that's, you know, that's what people say they always want. They want a motherfucker bossed over. I wonder who we could get now to be a, uh, like be <clears throat> on some rivalry type shit. Like what players? Like what teams? Could you could be rivals? Yeah, it's not. I don't feel like it's no superstar rivalries. Like the rivalry be yeah, nigga too friendly. Steph and, and Kobe. I mean, Steph and LeBron was like the last one. Yeah, yeah. But that shit wasn't fair. That nigga Steph had ninety two niggas with him, boy. <laughs> and when but I say also he ain't yet, but also it's like, does it balance out? Because Steph ain't nowhere near. What LeBron is in power and I mean, you know what I'm saying? still like, kind of going though. They just kicked him out the playoffs last season. Yeah, yeah. no, it ain't over. Yeah, it, it definitely ain't over. I don't want to but get the that thing out your head. with bro, like that. I think you know how they saying like, okay, how we was just talking rings. Now they saying like, LeBron got four rings. That he can never be good as Jordan or Kobe because they got more rings than him. So that's why I'm saying the money don't matter at the end when they still, like, if you want to be a GOAT, how you consider a that's GOAT. That's just opinions, though. Fuck them opinions. Fuck y'all. Them niggas Give listen. Money. Why you think them niggas care so much? No, I think, I mean, I think they what care because they want to be the best. At the end of the day? They, they, they yeah. got that in them. They got See, the, a nigga yeah, like me, I, I look at LeBron, right, right. I feel like nobody's better than LeBron. I say that. And the reason, I'm saying an all-around player. All time? That's what you're saying? Yeah, I, I got LeBron first. He got the most points. So you had Kareem before LeBron? No. <laughs> so why you just going? So why that's your magic pen? Why you just gauging on that point? Because it changes every time. Anytime it's to make LeBron number one, I change my metric. So now that he got the points. <laughs> so like, you, you, your goalpost move. That's yeah. your move. <laughs> I move that motherfucker. Shut up, man. No, nah, but I guess it all depends on who you like as a player. Yeah, I mean, I, I was able to see Jordan as a kid and... Now we kind of get to see the behind the scenes of the Jordan shit. Yeah. And it's like, oh, it take that to be a cha champion. You know what I'm saying? But I also got to see LeBron come up the most hyped ever and ever. sustain it for that long. Amazing. That's crazy, In bro. social media we gave a man. They gave Nike gave a man like 90 million before he even laced up. You know what I'm saying? And, and look at Zion and Williams. And paid off. They gave him that money. And he out here. See, that's what I'm talking about. That would that be me. That would be you? That would be me. <laughs> bitch, I'm in New Orleans. You'll see me with a gumbo and two bitches walking, walking down Bourbon Street. Eating gumbo, two bitches with me. They, they said Zion got a weight problem. They cut to him eating crawfish. <laughs> hey, <laughs> what you said? You said he had gumbo in his Gatorade bottle one time. Man, oh, oh, man. God. That I was mean, hilarious, bro. Bro, I forgot. <laughs> Zion messing with the porn stars. You would have been out there like that. Don't be that sloppy. Nah, it's like... I mean, just your business being out there. 
I just crazy. wouldn't give a fuck. If I like how I, if I got them 50 M's, I wouldn't give a fuck. They'd be like, who leaked the video? Bitch, me. Me. <laughs> <laughs> I was on live. <laughs> Paul Pierce. <laughs> Paul, Paul Pierce, Pierce a wild he nigga too. Paul Pierce, he wasn't even that wild. Like, like he'll say he wasn't tripping. Yeah, them niggas be, hey, them niggas be wild, man. But it's just the era where niggas come from. They don't give a fuck. When you get a certain age and some a certain amount of money, you stop giving a fuck. Yeah. As a nigga. Yeah, and it's probably like, nigga, I've been hiding this shit so long. Nigga. Yeah. I ain't trying to be hiding this shit no more. Fuck As it. anybody, yeah, especially out the league, like, who yeah. cares anymore? Yeah. Yeah. Man, nigga, appreciate you pushing up on the man. Plank. I had Go to come through, man. Shit. I'm glad to drop through. I was supposed to been came a minute ago, but yeah. Yeah, that why. Yeah. Hey, that why we had to keep you longer than you was supposed to keep keep oh, you. Oh, it's here. longer. Oh, I gotta order long, some more food. How long we did? Oh yeah, nigga, you went how long over time. You normally do about forty two. Oh man, that's it. <laughs> You don't even play a full game, <laughs> goddammit. You at least gotta go long as the game goes. Oh, shit. <laughs> no, man, but look, uh, send your well wishes. They done fired my boy Thad, man. That's what the pitch about? Yeah, that was you. Oh, oh, I thought he won. I thought he, <laughs> you I thought thought he won. won what? I thought he it was no, the that prize. Nigga lost. <laughs> <laughs> that's the memorial. Yeah, memorial. free Thad, man. <laughs> play the music. It's so hard. Now, what's up? You think no, we're going to pay for that. Cut that shit off. Oh, no, yeah, don't play. Yeah. Uh, D Clax will come up with a beat or him yeah. or J O N. They can put, put some shit. Hey, play some sad music. <laughs> you know, I, I lost me trying to play me some Pippin. Play, <laughs> play me some Pippin. Play me some sensitive play shit. Me some <laughs> <laughs> play me some sympathy. <laughs> <laughs> hey, it's zoom in on his face. Just That's like how that. they do with a nigga gone and ain't there no more. And then no, slow man. fade out. Yeah. Yeah, and it fade to, to the credit. But now, nah, anytime you want to come talk shit, talk sports I'm shit, you know where to come, bro. You be having guests sometimes, man. You be having, like, you know, NBA players. NFL yeah, man. Players. Might got to come and get shit signed. You know what For I mean? For sure. <laughs> we had, hey, just recently we saw uh, Jeff T was at the show. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, Jeff T. That. Yeah, Jeff T. Yeah, yeah, gotta get him through here, man. Yeah, we gotta get Jeff. T. Jeff T. Be having some funny they ass stories. He got the the realest NBA story. Bro, he don't mind. Yeah, you know what, niggas? Niggas try to be so cool that they don't be honest. Sometimes they don't want to make themselves like, damn, that was an embarrassing moment. Cause he talks about some shit like, nigga, you will tell that story. Yeah. I think he was telling what that Vince Carter called him garbage or something. T Mac. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you did tell yep, me it was T Mac. Yep, yep. When T Mac said, This the nigga who started? Yeah. <laughs> in front of the whole team. He said T Mac pulled up because they traded for T Mac. He said he pulled up in a Maybach in a, all Gu a big ass Gucci suit. <laughs> he said, <laughs> to the practice facility. He said he had T Mac. They had him starting over T Mac, and he was like, basically, T Mac was calling him garbage and shit and couldn't believe he was starting over him. Uh, <laughs> That's crazy. But the fact that you brought up, he had a big ass Gucci suit on. It's like, that's T-Mac respond. Did T-Mac say anything? I don't think oh, I know. I didn't hear Man. that. But you know he did have a big ass Mac suit probably on, up. Bro. That's the nigga who got 100 M's, no ring. And he don't do nothing, nigga. He probably chilling and shit on his money, nigga. He broadcasting. <laughs> The eye got better, didn't it? That hey, money nah. got that, that eye nigga, better. He was watching on it for... Oh, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> oh, bitch. Wait till I see you. <laughs> T Mac was my, one of my favorite players though. Yeah, me too. Same, yeah. Orlando T Mac and Houston T Mac. Both went gotcha. crazy. If but yeah, yeah. could have been a little more healthy too. They, Man, they, yeah. Grant Hill. You know Tim Duncan was supposed to be on that team. Yeah, but they told Stop. Doc Rivers told his wife the women don't get on the planes. Oh, okay. Stupid as fuck. Stupid, Stupid as as nigga. You say whatever. Yeah. You got to be like the army, nigga. Yeah. Whatever till you get a motherfucker to sign that paper. Hey, man, Doc, <laughs> Doc Rivers might have had good reason. What? Hey, the wives don't get on the plane. This is a freak party in here. <laughs> <laughs> you don't even want to see this, baby. <laughs> hey, not knowing Tim don't want that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Tim, we don't want your wife. Boy, it's going to be so many bitches and so many hoes. You going to, nigga, you, I'm talking about honey packs all over the motherfucking plane, nigga. T Mac was like, right, that nigga got there. Hey. Tim Dunn was like, nigga, I don't want that. Hey, hey. He got T Mac right. and Grant Hill with that right, shit, so right. he thought that was just the that, <laughs> that's the recruit like. process. This going. That nigga Tim Dunn was like, now nah, I'm gonna go nah. to San Antonio. Nah. <laughs> with Greg Popovich. Right. Boring as a motherfucker over there. Right. Yeah, for sure. That's fun. All right, right, man. We did it. Let's do it again. Anytime. <laughs>